I'm Chris Hassel. New Texas Longhorns head football coach Charlie Strong with some great news on Thursday. Three juniors coming back for their senior seasons. Nobody is leaving early, a bit of a rarity for the Longhorns. Cedric Reed was questionable, but the defensive end is coming back. Also running back Malcolm Brown and cornerback Quandre Diggs. And with much more on this, we bring in Max Olson, ESPN.com Texas reporter, also our Big 12 reporter. Uh, what kind of a boost is this, Max, for uh, Charlie Strong's new regime there in Texas? It's a big deal for, for Charlie Strong, and it reminds you a little bit of when Mac Brown first took over as head coach, his most important goal was convincing Ricky Williams to return, and he called that his first big commitment. This is the first big commitment for Charlie Strong is, is getting Cedric Reed to return. He had a, a big time season as a junior in 2013, or in first team All Big 12 honors. Had the 10 sacks, 19 tackles for loss, 79 tackles, and led the team in forced fumbles. So Cedric Reed, a, a big time prospect, he had told reporters after the Alamo Bowl that. Uh, he would only go out if uh, he, he believed he were to go in the first three rounds. Uh, and while that was still a possibility, he uh, he did believe that uh, you know coming back to Texas was the best thing for him, and, and it really a chance for him to, to chase what Jackson Jeffcoat did this season, the fellow defensive end and uh, Big 12 Defensive Player of the Year honors. So we wanted to come back and get his degree and uh, play one season for, for Charlie Strong. Certainly good news for the new head football coach there. Uh, off to a good start that way. Uh, but what, what do you think uh, the shape of the program is right now? Can, can he win right away? Is this a team that's set up to, to win a Big 12 championship that first year? It's a good question. And, and getting these three back is, is certainly important to that. Uh, Malcolm Brown, the running back, rushed for more than 900 yards and in, in, uh, filling in for Jonathan Gray, who went down to torn Achilles. Uh, so Texas will bring back two, you know, very talented rushers, both guys, uh, Gray and, and Brian, capable of going for a thousand yards next season. So the one thing to build on, on the offense, especially with David Ash, the quarterback, returning after missing most of this season with concussion issues, uh, it's going to be on that that defensive uh, front. You're, you, you know, you have Reed, you have him back. You lose Jeff Coat, you lose a, a big, big time defensive tackle in Chris Whaley. There's definitely some spots they're going to need to fill on that defense. They lose some important guys at all three levels. But, uh, you know, Charlie Strong certainly has a reputation for uh, being a defensive coach. And, it, it, you know, finding the rest of the coordinator and, and fixing that offense is probably going to be more important to him if they want to succeed in, in 2014. All right. The strong regime off to a strong start there down in Austin. Max Olson covers the Longhorns for ESPN.com. Thanks, Max. I'm Chris Hassel for ESPN Headlines.